me and the teacher sat down, we had a group with the kids, we said, you know, any questions, this is what it looks like, this is what she'll be having. At that point, she had a tank, like she just had a little tank beside her. She wasn't using too, too much, you know, um, she was wearing the little, na like the little mask. Um, yeah, and, you know, kids were very, very empathetic and mm -hmm. very sweet and kind, which I did not expect. Mm -hmm. Like, I think, I think we're raising our kids kind of right now, you know, um, I think mm -hmm. kids were a lot meaner in my day. And I was like, Ooh. well, and I think when you explain it to them and you take that mystery out and that, what's that for? What is yeah. that thing? If you just tell them, they usually do pretty well. It's when you don't yeah. and then they then they're trying to talk between each other and trying to figure out what's going on. Yeah. So and, and when you're and straightforward you know, like that, I think they can be really quite caring and wonderful. I, think I mean, I, mean, I love kids. Obviously, I'm a pediatrician. Yeah. But. <laughs> yeah, I think what I was trying to avoid, Marcy, was the fact that I didn't want them asking her questions all the time. Yeah. You know, just because you're using oxygen therapy, that doesn't mean that should be your life. Right. Right. Mm -hmm. That that's something she needed. Extra help is what I said to them. She needs a little bit of extra help. You know, her lungs are a little bit different. So, you know, it's just extra air. Mm -hmm. And that's kind of how I was putting it to them. Right. And, mm -hmm. you know, you have the cute little comments of, oh, my grandpa used one of those before. <laughs> right. You know? So cute. And I was like, yes. And then they were just kind. But you know what? With her personality, she loved everybody and everybody loved her. And she was like the kindest person in the world. So they were kind to her as well. Mm -hmm.